Welcome back everyone for the next part of Devil Survivor. In the last part, Ty got unconscious, we entered the factory and a lot of multiple doors showed up. So uh, yeah, in order to get past here and reach the doji, we need to take care of the doors first in order to unseal the door. And that means touching all of them and acquiring free shards. And of course helping out Jack Frost. That is our top priority, let's not forget it. I wonder which person I actually need to find for him though. That just need me here. Ah, okay. Okay, the top right one is a failure. Well, if it is like that, maybe I don't need to check all the doors if I'm lucky. So, top left, top right, middle left is next. Which is going to lead us. Let's see. Please, a new area. Seriously, need a new area. And. Perfect. Okay. What's that? Uh, it's a tainted gate. A demon should be able to pass through it. Ah! Could it? Well then. Um. Guy, I know. I know you don't really appreciate it, but uh, you're the only one who can actually pass through it. And uh, I need you to get some items, you know? Of course, you're not going to fight a single one of them. That's for sure. You're not really uh, a fighter. You're just, you are, well, you are a fighter, but not like this. Not like this. Okay. So first of all, item. That's good, and that would be pretty much all that I could grab around here. But at least uh, it wasn't really that deadly. It could have been worse after all. So, from here I am forced to go to the left side, and the left side leads me... ...to an Oni. Whoa! You're a novel show, right? Nah, man, I didn't mean it like that. I just saw this weird red guy sit past me. Oh god. Guy sit past at warp speed. That red cape of his was far out though. I'll gank it next time it comes around. So a red cape is around here. Okay, that's good to know. Oh wait, it's actually here. Look alive, Ray! <laughs> no job! No money! Can't go on! I've got nothing left! What? Really now? Really now? That was a boss in the last part. That was a boss fight. You also have to. You also have the doubt laser. Are you freaking kidding me? You were a boss, dude. How dare you show up again like this? <laughs> it's just a part afterwards. But afterwards, I could have met this guy first. I could have. Wait, work. I need work. I you can talk. Interesting. But, uh. Oh my god. They know. They simply know. But at least your heal isn't as strong as the last one. Money. As long as I have money, everything will be better. Oh, yeah. oh no you don't! What the hell? Is are you for real? There we go. Okay. So are you alright? Are you turning into a human again? Like the last one? Or do I need to do something else? More Matt! Oh god, I love this dude! Are you becoming my pants in this game? With all the magic. Anti mines. Appreciate it. Yeah, he turned into a man. The red cape reverted to his true human form. What are you doing here? This place is off limit to non employees. Uh, what gives? I'm aching all over. Well, I did have a fight with you. I guess he doesn't remember being a red cape. But that's good, actually. I don't think anybody, anybody want to live like that. 
with that kind of memories. <laughs> oh, I get it. You were playing detective and snuck in. I used to do that when I was younger. But stay out of the warehouse. The company president is, uh, is in there and you will get in trouble. Why don't you run along home and have your dad around the house? I need to get back to work. See ya, kids. Wait. You don't even know that the factory is going down? Uh... Sounds like we're heading for the warehouse, Ray. Seems like it. And of course we need to go further to the left. By the way... Oh, that's another exit point. But uh, first of all... I need to heal myself up really quickly because there's a shard and there's a chance. Of course! Of course! Why wouldn't they? <laughs> Is it the big one again? Please don't tell me it's the big one again. Don't do it. Don't do it! You're strong! 15 magic! 15 magic! I erased you, my dude! You can't just do this to me! Oh god. Okay. So as long as the big one aren't around, there's nothing to fear. Actually, let me just shoot this. Yeah. Never mind. Never mind. This is the worst kind of situation. Holy hell! Okay, summon. I need a healer. You, come out. Yep, please. Seriously. I need a heal. Thank you very much. That does like 150 damage! 150! It's not even funny! Out of the way. One, two, three. We have another jump. Let's go. Miss A! That is, you were already dead. You can't just do that. Seriously. That is not how it works. But it seems like that attack is only going to half my current HP from the looks of it. So, healing support, please. Oh god. Slap from the back. One, two, three. Out of the way. One, two, three. Okay. Dude, come over here. There we go. So I need to press L1 to summon her right to my si side. This one, take her. Okay. Well, at least my character doesn't go for a killing streak like last game, where it actually kills the whole party if I, if I don't uh, watch out for that. More vitality. Yeah, I think you might need that. So, that would be another shot, right? There's something on the ground. Pick it up? Yes, of course. Red shot. So how expensive would that be? Here? Oh no! No! Why are you always so expensive? Why? Let's just get out of here. I'm done here. Yeah, I, I have my shot. I, I don't need to heal. I... Ah. Oh. But he did say he is in the warehouse, right? Let's uh, escape. You're fine. You're not gonna die, right? You're not gonna die. Okay. Because I just realized I didn't heal him at all. Which is kind of bad. Because he only has like 24 HP. One single hit and that would have been a kill. So, are you here? No. Yeah, maybe. Maybe it's just simply left. Yeah, there's a chance he's just simply set. Uh, he simply left. So I was middle left. That means next is middle right. Let's watch out. I don't want to step on tie after all. So that leads me back to the start. Okay. So, okay, from here, we're going back to the left one, 
And hopefully this time around it leads us uh, to a new location. It should technically lead us to a new location. Uh, hello? What are you doing here right beside me? If I didn't save us all from that demon doll, who else is going to do it? You saved them? You are trapped in a labyrinth. I know you're going to die. It's too difficult for you. I won't, uh, I won't know unless I try. I'm the only hope this factory has left. But what am I supposed to do? Okay, then I guess I need to tell you that you're actually going to run or you're going to die via demons. Mr. Daidoji said something like that when he asked us to leave the factory. But I like it here. How could anyone sit back and watch us as something they love is taken away? I won't die. And neither will this factory. True. True. If you really love something, you're going to fight for it. So, where exactly are we? There's something to the left that I could technically... Break. Okay, before we do that, let me check out the right side. Which leads to exit. And... Well... Hmm. Wait, there's something to the bottom right corner that I didn't see yet. Since it wasn't really connected at the time. Oh god! That's a lot of stuff, dude! I'm not gonna fight. <laughs> it's alright, it's alright. I'm totally fine. Ah, Anzu! Asumi, I mean. Oh, fiddlestick. I can't find my glasses anywhere. Every one of those stone passages looked the same to me. I just can't see a thing without my glasses. So you're looking for glasses. Damn it! What's with that stupid doll? It drives me crazy! Uh, well, first of all, you need to cool down, okay? What? I am cooled down! Don't go around judging people. Well, I can see that you're totally fierce and hyped about it. So how about... A drink. You're still just a student. You ain't old enough to think about stuff like that. <laughs> just like Mr. Daidoji. He used to take me to bars even though he wouldn't drink himself. Yeah, blowing a casket won't do me any good. I should take it easy. True, true. Seems like Mr. Daidoji kind of helped everyone out, right? Like, seriously, he helped everyone out. By the way, she's still searching for her glasses. Maybe my, my dude could help. I didn't see anything, though. That's a bit dramatic. Uh, There's uh, a few of those. So, yeah. Already around, I could cover some mag by doing this. And XP from the big encounter would actually be good for me. Right? So let's see, how much did I get? 200, 60 loyalty, but 100 mag. I take it. So if I go up here, I can go further to the right. Which in fact leads me to... Another gate. Two gates. Can I find anything around here? Huh. No. Okay. So I think that was the gun door, right? Yeah, yeah that should be the gun door. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to charge. I'm going to thrust attack. And just like that. I'm just going to reload to my normal bullets. And you're not the right one. Okay, which one are you? No idea. Okay, sort of text. Not sort of text. So, listen to my order. See you against that thing. Maybe it works? Nope. Okay, then we can also try Mufu. Oh. Uh, and. 
just my order. Who forgets that thing? Not gonna work. Then I'm gonna summon my other dude who can actually use fire. Then you are going to use fire against that thing. There we go. Perfect. Great. Didn't really cover the cost, but still, I did get a check for shit for that. So, with that thing destroyed... Oh, that's a shot. What? 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 Wait, this is going to be troublesome. Uh, yep. The magic is low. And if that is the case, I need to swap over to this dude. Because those bug girls have a weakness to fire. And they can boost my defense. Ha! <laughs> you sucker fell for it. I totally prepared. <laughs> now die! Mm hmm. So first of all, buff us. Next, Bragi, her. One, two, three. One, two, three. So many crits, I absolutely love it. Then we use stickers because it does a lot of damage. Oh wait. Don't you dare! Don't you freaking dare! God damn it! Okay, spin attack. Out of the way. Free. One, two, three. Okay, out of the way because she's using that skill again. One, two, three. Ah, shoot. Okay. You want it? You're gonna get it. And it was totally a miss. Oh well. At least he got a level up. Which increases his magic. Uh, well, um, yeah. I mean, it would have been better if you had more, more strength. But then again, the physical attack is so slow, I guess the magic heals up would be better for you. Oh well. At least he still has the buff, right? He still has the buff. So, that would be the last shot. But I still need to find... Jack Frost. Friend. Where the heck is it? Blood Crystal Barrel. Oh, huh. boy. Now we can break that seal. Shake a leg, Ray. We can't let Kyoji escape this time. That is true. Let me see, did I actually cover all the corners? It seems like I did. But I didn't really find that other guy. Hmm. Maybe I wasn't really supposed to help out Jack Frost. But I kind of feel sorry for that little guy. He was looking for his friend. I mean, it could be. He did say there is a chance that his friend already left. There is a chance. And I also weren't really able to find the, the glasses from the demon. But well, I'm sure they should be fine. I don't even remember that they even had the glasses to begin with. So, okay then. It is finally time. Open the door. Break the seal with the blood crystal barrel. Yes, it is time. We need to save that dude and finally get a clue about uh, uh, Kaya. Like seriously, we've been looking for that girl for three parts now and we didn't find a single lead that actually leads to her location. So far at least. The seal is broken. Raido felt the presence of a strong demon. Ooh, go inside? Yes, of course. We kind of have... Wait, he's still human? Oh. I was kind of expecting to see him in his uh, red cape form. Well, don't worry, I have your cane if you need it. But all I wanted to do was save the factory. 
Are you even recognizing us in this room? You're the detective! Did you come here after me? It's about time. I'm going to tell you everything. About my brother. About my niece. Really? Hmm? Or maybe not? Oh no. Why is it? it still looks so disgusting. Huh? What the hell? What is that? You didn't die, right? Uh... didn't even turn into a red cape this time. I see you made it through the Matrix Labyrinth, relatively unscattered. Yeah, it wasn't really that bad. Especially if you have a map. Not bad at all, detective. I mean, Devil Summoner. But you're still no match for me. Fawn and Black, dude. As I am the greatest Dark Summoner, Rasputin. I trust that you've heard of me before. Rasputin? What? And you call yourself a devil summoner? Oh, dude, you don't even know how many names there are. Do you even know how much trouble I have with the town names? Even though I already played through four? Some of them are similar, and I still have trouble. <laughs> Ch children, today's are so ignorant of history. Oh. Well, well, I never was really that good in history. Well, putting that aside, I'm sure there are things you've been wondering about for some time. A pity you will die without any answer. Alright, here's everything I know about Kyoche Daidoji. Why would you say that if you're about to kill me? His transformation, which you refer to as Red Cape, and that object that was expelled from his body. It was an object. First, the object is Hiroko. I wouldn't call it object, it had a face and was laughing. It's a monster that grows by feeding on a person's fear and anxiety. As the Hiroko grows, it slowly alters its whole body. So you see, the monster you call Red Cape is just Hiroko in an advanced stake, uh, state. Once it grows stronger, the Hiroko moves, uh, moves to the next step, which is what you just saw. A full-grown Hiroko leaves his host and enters the next phase of the project. I'm sure you would like to know what project I'm talking about, but I can't tell you anything more about it. There's something to be said for following the client's order. I am not at liberty to give away much just yet. But there's something I can tell you about Kaya, the girl you've been looking for. You know where she is? She's also playing an important role in the project. You can try as long as you like, but we won't let you have her. I should stop though. Wouldn't want to say too much. Again, why would you even say that? The little clues I have, the better it would be for you. 
I'm a busy man. I need to be on my way. Don't worry. I'll leave someone behind to keep you company. Farewell, Raido Kusunoha. I see. I see. Seems like uh, your tubes are at those stores, huh? Oh. Oh, it's the mushroom lady! Wasn't she the girl with the Moodle skills? Oh, <laughs> Master Rasputin, need with the finger. I will send you down the river Styx myself. Uh huh. First, uh, Paco Pacha. Buff. Two, three. Oh, wait. You're weak! Never mind! Seriously? Ah, right. Mushroom. Mushroom. Duplication. This is my secret art. Unknown to many men. Can you survive this, Sunny? Well, if you're all the same... Uh, if you all have the same strength, I guess it should be alright. Especially if you think about it. Oh god, ice! Oh cool. Wait, out of the way. Then we use flame shots to burn her down. And still going, boy. This time they're three of us. Yeah, I noticed. We don't really need to mention it. Uh, should I swap over? No, wait. Let's see. Uh, I should probably swap over to somebody else. Your eyes is good. You have a healing skill. Perfect. Seriously? Did you hear me? You're confused? How did that happen? You already left me. Uh. Yeah, eat that. How the freaking hell did that happen? Okay, fine. That is the case. Uh, you're dead. It's her aura, the circle. With the fire, that's alright. Well, uh, Moshuba, you and me, my girl, please, you're alive. Mean it. Oh shoot. Oh shoot, confusion is broken. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> oh, 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 that's uh. It's kind of hard to dodge if you're confused and your directions are all uh, kind of iffy. And now I'm slow as heck. Well, that's uh... Okay, one of them is down. <laughs> God, wait. This one is really... I've got both of them. It's alright. Keep it. Keep distracting them. Don't hit me. Do not hit me. The magic is too strong if you hit me. <laughs> that would actually kill me by accident. So, more, more. I'll keep on sticking. Uh, I, I keep on kicking until you give your uh, give yourself up. Seriously. Three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Come on, dude. Step out of it! I believe! You can snap out of it! I can totally tank that hit for you if I have to. More? More. The actual one. Pretty good summoner. I will take the gloves off from now on. Eight. That means. Blast shot! One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Shoot. Step. Okay, I need to uh, let her heal a little bit. Girl. No, no. Don't do that. Heal. Only heal. There. I lost Master Rasputin. 
Yes! After so many <laughs> spammy moves, <laughs> confusion is the worst thing! Seriously, if my own demon attacks me, I literally die in 666 XP. Oh, I love that. But I guess he got away. You live? Talk about tragedy. He can't even die as a human. Wait, he dies? Hey, Ray. About that Rasputin Piker. And his... Hiroko business. We can't really ignore something that serious. Besides, it sounds like he knows where Kaya was. Thinking maybe we should run all uh, we should run all of this by Narubi? Yeah, we probably should. After taking that guy along, Tia. Huh. That certainly sounds like an ordeal, Raido. A dark summoner. If I have to guess, I would wager. He's going to get in the way of our investigation. At least you, you were able to save those factory workers, right? Not to mention Tai, that is true. But we can sit by while that Dark Summoner continues doing who knows what. True. And like you said, he knows where Kaya Daidoji is. I still wish he had more to go on, but at least this is something. Still. Who could this Rasputin guy be, really? Well... <gasps> oh! How did you show up here? I have come with a missive of import, uh, of import from Raido Kusunoha the 14th. Okay. Hey! How have you been? Fancy a drink? Maybe a smoke? Ugh, please spare me. This is an urgent matter. Raido, I've come... I've come about the dark summon you encountered. Rasputin is a Russian monk who, according to records, perished 15 years ago. But in actuality, he is a dark summoner, one who is beyond our square of, inf uh, square of influence. Hold the phone. We toil, using the power of devil summoners to maintain peace in this world. Not only in Japan, but also other countries around the world. However, there are some who choose to use their power for selfish ends. We don't know the motives of such summoners, but their values are different from ours. We refer to them as dark summoners. Though we know, <laughs> we know not what they are after, we do know their skills are unmatched. If you choose to approach Vesputin, use the utmost caution. True, true. I mean, he did have a very strong demon after all. Just like that, she left. <laughs> well, she's really only here to say her business and goes back to her shrine. Hmm, must really be dangerous if she came all this way just to tell us. In any case, going after this Putin is about all we can do at this point. This missing girl, the mystery of the Red Cape, the Hiruko, was Putin's the only guy we know who has all the answers. I'll work through the details in a little bit. You need to rest first. True. Wait. Oh! Well, that was much shorter than episode 2, since we had to travel so much in order to find all the clues. Interesting. Anyways, since uh, they're going to give me a save point, I'm going to use it to make a cut. I hope you guys had fun, and see you tomorrow. Until then, bye-bye.